The judgment of the Jagdpanzer 38T, also known as the Hetzer. Firstly, let's start with the backstory of the tank. The Jagdpanzer 38, later known as Hetzer, was a German light tank destroyer of the World War II. Based on a modified Czechoslovakian Panzer 38T chassis, which was a light tank. The Hetzer was intended to be more cost effective than the much more ambitious Jagdpanther and the Jagdtiger designs of the same period. Using a proven chassis, it avoided the mechanical problems of the larger armored vehicles. The Hetzer first entered service with the Heeres Panzerjäger Battalion 731 in July 1944. This unit was sent to Army Group North on the Eastern Front. One report from the Eastern Front describes that a company of Hetzers destroyed 20 enemy tanks without any losses. So it almost seems that this weapon is the Wunderwaffe that the Germans have been looking for. It's relatively fast and reliable, but there's one weird thing about it. It uses the same cannon as the Jagdpanzer Fear, but the Hetzers gun is more inaccurate. Why is that? It's almost like the Tiger fight in Fury, like it's either the gunners can't aim or it's because of the fact that they were moving, but they were moving through mud and that kind of mud should just make the gun more stable than when moving on a regular road. He's coming out! Fire fire! Hold her, AP, AP! Uh, hit him! On one! Uh, on. What do you want, Tom? Cover AP, AP, smash him. You're clear, boy! Ah. AP, 500 yards, fire! Clear, boy, get going down! Again! Fuck, Ray, put it in, now. Clear! On the wall! Stop! Shot! Oh, God! God damn it! Fuck! Head up! Car! On the wall! It's a fucking beast! Gordo, flank left, left! Davis cross, flank right, flank right! Copy, right dead, right dead! Traverse left! Davis is lining up! Fire! They shoot the son of a bitch. He's lining up on Roy. God damn it! I said fire. Fire. As you could see, that accuracy was pretty bullshit, because the guns, they weren't even shaking all that much. But now, back to the topic about the Hetzer. 75mm Pac-39 L-48 was a 7.5cm German Second World War era anti-tank gun. The gun was used to equip Jagdpanzer Fear and Jagdpanzer 38T, the Hetzer tank. No towed version of the weapon was available, but the Pac-39 was an electrically fired weapon fitted with a semi-automatic breech mechanism and a 48 caliber long barrel that's relatively short for a tank destroyer. It was a formidable gun, able to destroy most common allied tanks up to 1000 meters away. It used the same ammunition as the 75mm KWK-40 of the Panzer IV and 75mm Stuck 40 gun. The Pac-39 was manufactured from 1943 onwards. As the guns are identical, it's a possibility that this difference is because of the weight difference. During my research, I found out that the Jagdpanzer Fear weighs around 25.8 tons, while the Hetzer weighs only 15.7 tons, so that means that the recoil affects the Hetzer more. The only real complaint that I have is the frontal bottom armor, or the belly, because most tanks will penetrate you there, and when they do, your transmission will be disabled, and in real combat probably never coming back. And since you don't have an actual turret, if they try to flank you, then you probably are toast if your brigade can't help you.